Hello YouTube. I'm going to start this off real quick with a little bit of eye candy in the background. This is a, a grenade launcher adapter for a pineapple grenade for an M2, no, M1 Garand. Well, anyway, first off, well this is also going to have some silver in it. Um, let me, first I'm going to show is this beat up 2005. Libertad, come on, focus please. There, there, oh, okay, there it is. Well, it's a little beat up around the edges and on the back. It matches my beat up 2005 American Silver Eagle. Well, talking about beat up coins. I got this 1999 American Silver Eagle in the generic silver tray. There's only four rounds in the generic silver tray. Well, of course, silver's at 14 and change. An ounce. Well, put that one over there. And for the price of that one, it was about 16 something that I got it for. I got this 1988 American Silver Eagle. But it is really tarnished. About 27 years. Tarnishing. Oh. I got another coin stuck to my arm over here. Well, put that one there. Next round, I'm going to show is a half ounce Andrew Jackson round. It's from about 1975. Okay. Okay. And then my first, also, in that coin shop, uh, Canadian Maple Leaf with the Canadian Maple Leaf Privy. That's my first Maple Leaf. Very beautiful coin. Better to see it in person than it is to see it on a screen. Then. For $38, I got this guy. The one and a half ounce polar bear. The $8 with the Queen Elizabeth II on it. Put that one over there. I'll turn this around so you can see the maple leaf. The next round I came across at a, a pawn shop. This is actually, well, flip this around. Rotate it, come on. A 1985 American Prospector Butterfingers. Um, Englehard round. One quarter ounce. There it is. I think I paid almost about almost $18 for this guy. I think online they're going for like $32 or more but the coin shop place weighed this one and it read half an ounce 15 point 15.5 let's try this angle hard 0.8 I guess that's what means 0.8 Well, that's what I come ac came across this time for my silver hunting. Everyone have a good evening and have a good one.